Yeah, they're squirting. Okay, here is a video of the frame. Hopefully it comes out, because we're just taking this on my iPod. There we go. You can see it's actually surface rust, but it's very solid. Me to call her first. You want me to just try to call her now and I'll call her back after? Oh, 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 oh. Okay. All right, yeah. All right, that makes sense. She has a room here. Yeah, probably consider the hotel with Grandpa Paul. They can't come on. There's no way I would. This is actually the worst area of the frame. You see the old oval holes. Still very solid, even though it's the worst area. So I got to stay up there another night. The frame mounts. Why didn't they just go to one of those? They have full capacity. There's not a room to be had anywhere down there. Well, yeah. Grandpa's and now for the passenger side. Definitely is in better condition than the other side. Although, like I said, both are very decent. So that is the extent of the frame, and a lot of the factory coating is peeling off. So it may look w worse in the pictures, but very solid. And since I'm taking this video anyways, here's the interior, because I'm not sure how many pictures I took of it. Um, I'm not sure if, which one the windshield wiper is supposed to be here, but it does not seem, the windshield wipers don't seem to be working right now. This just seems to be stuck, so it could just be a stuck switch. Like I, I think I told you on the phone, the uh, gauges and everything don't seem to work. Could just be fuses. Honestly, I'm just in such a hurry right now, I haven't even looked at them. But I mean, it could just be that sitting outside with no top all the years too, just some. I think gauges have a little rust on them and corrosion. But all right, overall, that's it.